Conservative Cabinet ex-minister calls for second EU referendum since assuming the Prime Ministership after the British public's unexpected decision to leave the European Union, Theresa May has found herself caught between opposing camps of the Conservative Party, each threatening to tear her down. As British Prime Minister Theresa May faces escalating pressure from the so-called hard Brexiteers, outrage over her pursuit of a soft Brexit with Europe and her Chequers plan, one of her former cabinet ministers and a lead Remain supporter in the Conservative Party has come out in favour of holding a second referendum on Britain's EU membership. In an article for the Times newspaper, former Education Secretary Justine Greening rubbished the government's Brexit blueprint, agreed more than a week ago, as the worst of both worlds and that it would suit no one. We'll be dragging Remain voters out of the EU for a deal that means still complying with many EU rules, but now with no say on shaping them. It's not what they want, and on top of that when they hear that Leave voters are unhappy, they ask, what's the point, she insisted in her article. Greening expanded upon her views in a later radio interview, stating that Parliament had become gridlocked on the issue and incapable of finding a resolution and that the only solution would be to put the question back to the public in a second referendum. Justine Greening served as the Conservative government's Education Secretary from mid-2016 until a cabinet reshuffle in January when she resigned her position. In the United Kingdom's 2016 EU membership referendum, Ms Greening backed the Remain campaign and has now become the party's most senior figure to advocate a second vote on the matter.